everybody, hope you are well. I came down to the beach for a little walk and thought I'd give you a market update. Uh, so what is going on here in Corona Del Mar? I'm down on the beach uh, just south of Little Corona. Uh, there's short cliffs right behind me and just south of that right here is Cameo Shores, the southernmost community in Corona Del Mar where we have a 14 half million dollar listing hitting the market in a couple weeks. You're not gonna wanna miss that. So right now in Corona Del Mar, there's about, there's 113 active listings. And that's down, in February there's about 150. So why is that? Well, a lot of sellers have decided to wait until the COVID dust settles a little bit more and people have an understanding of what's going on in the market. Uh, but also a lot of people pulled their house off the market. There's 40 listings in the last 60 days or so when all the stay home, stay home orders went into effect that have either been put on hold, canceled, or withdrawn. So right now in springtime, we're usually seeing an uptick in inventory. Uh, obviously, we're, we're a little low right now. So inventory is down. Demand is still strong. Uh, there's 18 homes currently in escrow in Corona Del Mar. So that's a leading indicator of what's going to be closing here in the next 30, 45 days. Uh, in the last 30 days, there were about 18 homes that closed escrow for an average price point of about three point, just under 3.1 million. And in the same time period last year in 2019, the same 30 day time period, there's 25 homes that sold for an average price of about 3.2 million. So the average price is down only about three and a half percent, which all things considered what we're dealing with in this environment, not bad. Uh, so the real estate market staying strong, demand is staying strong. It's just the number of sales that are down year over year over that 30 day time period is about down 28 uh, percent we do expect a lot of pent-up demand coming in the next few months for those that have been waiting or for those that have been stuck at home for the last 60 days and have been able to pay closer attention to their kitchens and their backyard and their master bedrooms and bathrooms and are thinking you know what I might need something different I might need a little more um, so you know buyers especially with the current interest rates um, you know those with a, a long-term perspective on their home ownership they're definitely out and about and there will be opportunities out there they're not gonna be easy to find but there will be opportunities so if you're out actively searching on the market um, let me know I'd love to help you and we can talk about some of those opportunities that might be coming up for sellers Right now, as I mentioned, there's about 20 homes that just in the last 12 days, 12 days in May, that have come up active or coming soon on the MLS. So these sellers that have been waiting, now you're seeing them stay ahead of the curve because we do see a surge, a little surge of inventory coming with those that have been waiting that are coming on the market. So if you're thinking about selling, whether you're moving up or you're downsizing, uh, best to strategize now stay ahead of the curve before all these other homes are listed for sale. Right now, more important than ever to pick the right agent, help, help you price your home properly, help you market your home. If you need help, if you wanna sit down and strategize, I'd love to talk to you. I'm Andy Stavros, I'll see you later.